Thank you. Well, Vermont Senator Patrick Leahy is wrapping up a nearly 50-year career in Washington this year and winning praise from communities back home for his work to try to help. Leahy appeared at two events today in central Vermont, and NBC5's Tyler Baronski joins us now live with more on the reception he received. Tyler? Yes, Stu, the senator has impacted so many across Vermont. Today, he stopped at Cross at Brook Middle School, celebrating the success of the Farm to School initiative. Then he made his way to, the, to Waterbury, where victims who have worked with the Vermont Network against domestic and sexual violence thank him for all his support. And with retirement on the horizon, it's interactions like today he says he'll miss the most. I think it's honor. A sentiment echoed throughout the day for Senator Patrick Leahy as he was recognized for two of his efforts. The first stop, Cross at Brook Middle School, for his farm to school initiatives enriching the connection education practices have with local food producers. Senator Leahy has been a big part of the farm to school movement and what, what it really caused us to, to be a leader in that, uh, that area. So we're thrilled to be able to recognize him for his work. Students anxiously anticipating his arrival and then thrilled to showcase what they've learned to him. The kids were very excited to have him here today and I think it's just the insurance that we, we are doing the right thing. And I have so many of these kids going, oh, we grew this, we grew that. And my heart just glows knowing that this is working. Stop number two was to hear testimonies from crime victims. As a former prosecutor, it's something near and dear to Senator Leahy. You hear these horrendous things happening to people. And I made that a point, especially when I became chairman of the judiciary, to get programs to help crime victims. After eight terms and nearly five decades at the helm, Senator Leahy says he never envisioned this type of tenure. I stayed long enough to get the seniority to do things for Vermont, and as a native of this state, that really made me feel good. What will he miss most then? Oh, I'll miss all the people I I worked with uh, in both parties in, in the Senate. And his parting message to the state? Well, I just want them to know I was honest and the priorities of Vermont were the first in my priorities. And secondly, it was the country, and third, the world, by starting with Vermont. Yeah, no doubt, Senator Lee, he has left his mark on the state, and he knows Vermont will make the right choice on who to elect next. Live in the newsroom, Tyler Bronski, NBC5 News.